the comrades required for this experiment are esp32 board lcd display i2c converter mq135 sensor dht11 sensor connecting cable and connecting wires Now log into the Bling Dot Cloud website. Now go to this templates page. Click on new template. Here we need to give the template name and select the board as ESP32 and connection type as Wi-Fi. And click on done button. Now go to data streams and click new data stream and select virtual pin and enter the pin name as temperature. and virtual pin is 0 and data type is double and select the maximum value as 100 and click create and click again new data stream to create a virtual pin for humidity and virtual pin is v1 data type is double and maximum value is 100 click create now the third pin is for gas value again click virtual pin enter the pin name and virtual pin uh, pin number v2 and data type as double and enter the maximum value as 600 now click create now go to events tab and click add new event and enter any event name now click on the warning tab and give the message and click this radio button send event to notification tab and again click on the send event to timeline button now go to the notifications menu and click enable notifications and now select the email to option as device owner and push notifications to that also we need to select as device owner now change this to one minute and click create now go to web dashboard and drag three widgets one for temperature and second one for humidity and third one for the gas value and now click the arrow button and upload the program to the node mcu board now the program is uploaded to the esp8266 board now download the blink iot application from the play store now open the app 
Here we can see the template which we created in the Blink dashboard. Now click on this template. Now click on this plus button and we need to add three gauges. Like we did in the Blink web dashboard. First one for temperature, second one for humidity and the third one for a gas value. Now click on the first gauge and select the data stream. Now go back and now click on the second one and here select the data stream as humidity. Now again go back and click on the third gauge and select the data stream as gas value. Now go back and again go back. Now we have created the template in the Blink dashboard as well and now we can check the output. We will get the pollution alert notification in Blink dashboard in timeline menu. At the same time, we will also get an email.